The wicked flee when no one is pursuing, but the righteous are bold as a lion. By the transgression of a land, many are its princes, but by a man of understanding and knowledge, so it endures. A poor man who oppresses the lowly is like a driving rain which leaves no food. Those who forsake the law praise the wicked, but those who keep the law strive with them. Evil men do not understand justice, but those who seek the Lord understand all things. Better is the poor who walks in his integrity than he who is crooked, though he be rich. He who keeps the law is a discerning son, but he who is a companion of gluttons humiliates his father. He who increases his wealth by interest and usury gathers it for him who is gracious to the poor. He who turns away his ear from listening to the law, even his prayer, is an abomination. He who leads the upright astray in an evil way will himself fall into his own pit, but the blameless will inherit good. The rich man is wise in his own eyes, but the poor who has understanding sees through him. When the righteous triumph, there is great glory, but when the wicked rise, men hide themselves. He who conceals his transgressions will not prosper, but he who confesses and forsakes them will find compassion. How blessed is the man who fears always, but he who hardens his heart will fall into calamity. Like a roaring lion and a rushing bear is a wicked ruler over a poor people. A leader who is a great oppressor lacks understanding, but he who hates unjust gain will prolong his days. A man who is laden with the guilt of human blood will be a fugitive until death. Let no one support him. He who walks blamelessly will be delivered, but he who is crooked will fall all at once. He who tills his land will have plenty of food, but he who follows empty pursuits will have poverty and plenty. A faithful man will abound with blessings, but he who makes haste to be rich will not go unpunished. To show partiality is not good, because for a piece of bread a man will transgress. A man with an evil eye hastens after wealth, and does not know that want will come upon him. He who rebukes a man will afterward find more favor than he who flatters with the tongue. He who robs his father or his mother and says, It is not a transgression, is a companion of a man who destroys. An arrogant man stirs up strife, but he who trusts in the Lord will prosper. He who trusts in his own heart is a fool, but he who walks wisely will be delivered. He who gives to the poor will never want, but he who shuts his eyes will have many curses. When the wicked rise, men hide themselves, but when they perish, the righteous increase. Thank you for watching this video. I pray that you were blessed by the reading of the scripture. I wanna encourage you that if you gathered with multiple people, that each one of you pick a verse from this chapter. Pick that verse that was highlighted to you, the one that stood out and discuss it. What is the Lord saying through this verse? How is it speaking to you? I also wanna encourage you that you can do this every month. Because there's 31 chapters in Proverbs, at the end of the month, you can start over. And every time you visit these chapters, I guarantee you, you'll find something new to talk about. It's life changing. We have done this as a family for about two years or so, and we've seen a change in our mindset, how we look at wisdom, how we look at foolishness, how we look at righteous living. It's a complete character change for sure. The whole point is to get it in you, not just to go through it as a, as a checklist, but get it in you and live it out. So again, I hope that you are blessed by these videos. Share this with your friends and your family. Let's get the word out there. Come on. Thank you again in Jesus' name.